Hello everyone, welcome back to the map of mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this nice math olympiad algebraic challenge. And here we have a to the power of b equals to b to the power of a. And here we find the values of a and b. So that um, the very first step we are going to do is here first we assume that um, our exponent uh, b equals to some constant multiplied by a, a so here we suppose that our exponent b equals to uh, k times of a and over k be the uh, any constant so here we write k is any constant so now in order to find the value of a and b we substitute the value of b on both of the sides of this equation and uh, this equation uh, will become uh, after substituting the value of b as a to the power of k times of a equals to here we have our base is b and b equals to k a and its whole power k whole power a so uh, here we uh, just uh, uh, we just take uh, the exponent 1 over a on both of the sides or we take power 1 over a on both of the sides of this equation in order to eliminate this a on the exponent so when we remove this a from the exponent then we easily get the value of k so in order to find the value of this k we need to take the eighth power or we need to take the eighth root eighth root on both of the sides and we write it as a to the power of k a and its whole power 1 over a equals to k a and its power a and its whole power 1 over a so uh, now in the next step we uh, here we need little bit simplifications uh, so you see that when we have exponent to the exponents and then these exponents are multiplied by each other and here we obtain a to the power of k a multiplied by 1 over a and similarly here these exponents are multiplied by each other and we write it as k a and its whole power a multiplied by 1 over a so in the next step uh, we will multiply this a with this a and uh, this expression uh, will becomes a to the power of k and it is whole equals to here also you see that this a is cancelled out by this a and we get in the right hand side is k times of a but here uh, we uh, in order to find the value of uh, a and b here first we find the value of k so when you find the value of k and we substitute it here then we easily get the value of uh, a and b so here we first find the value of a so a uh, value of k so uh, we move this a to the left hand side and we get our k equals to a to the power of k divided by a and here you see that the bases are same but the exponent of the denominator is one so we subtract this exponent to the upper term and we write it as a to the power of k minus one so uh, now uh, in order to find the value of a here first uh, we uh, remove the exponent k minus one and we know about k minus one because k be the constant term so uh, we can take k minus k minus one root on both of the sides or in other words uh, we will take um, k one over k minus one power on both of the sides in order to eliminate this k minus one so here we easily get the value of a and we write it as a to the power of k minus one and its whole power one over k minus 1 so here you see that this k minus 1 is cancelled out by this k minus 1 and uh, we easily get the value of a equals to k to the power of 1 over k minus 1 so this is the value of a but here our k uh, becomes uh, 2 3 
4, 5 and up to so on. Because here we cannot take a equals to 1 because when or we take a equals to 1 then the exponent of this k will becomes infinity so that we cannot take a here k equals to 1 so we take any other value other than 1. So we get the value of a equals k to the power of 1 over k minus 1 and now we put the value of a in this equation in this equation and we easily get the value of k. So now here uh, we first copy down the uh, uh, upper term and we have b equals to k times of a and here we substitute the value of a and you get b equals to k multiplied by k to the power of 1 over k minus 1 and here you see that the exponent of this k is 1 and bases are same so we add these exponents and we write it as k to the power of 1 plus 1 over k minus 1 and now in the next step uh, we will take the LCM of this exponent and we get the value of b equals to k to the uh, exponent of uh, here we take the LCM k minus 1 and it will becomes k minus 1 and plus 1 so this plus 1 and minus 1 are cancelled out by each other and we get k to the power of k over k minus 1 so here you easily get the value of b equals to k to the power of k over k minus 1 so this is the value of b and now in the other way we have the value of a which we already find is that a equals to k to the power of 1 over k minus 1 so these are the general values of a and b so in order to find the particular values of a and b so we substitute here our k equals to 2 3 4, 5 and up to so on. So here first I can uh, uh, find the value when our k is 2. So we put this value of k equals to 2 here. Then you get b equals to 2 to the power of 2 over 2 minus 1. And we get here 2 to the power of 2 minus 1 becomes 1 and 2 over 1 becomes 2. So here you easily get the value of b equals to 4 and similarly when we put k equals to 2 in uh, here then we get our a equals to um, 2 to the power of 1 over 2 minus 1 and we get a equals to 1 over 2 minus 1 is uh, becomes 2. So we get the value of uh, a equals to 2 so uh, when k equals to 2 we get the values of a and b and similarly you will substitute k equals to 3 4 5 and up to so and then you easily get the different values of a and b so this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos